Okay, okay, so we're going to create the first screen, which says just getting the fucking weather. Now, we are going to work with local state. Now, when you make React Native and React apps, you shouldn't always only work with, work with local state. You should work with some kind of a state management library like Movex or um, Redux or uh, some flux implementation or something or whatever in this course we cannot touch that because it's super complex so if you want to learn how to handle a lot of state a lot of data different screens um saving to disk all those stuff go to the full stack course that we have prepared when we are going to actually make something that will work for a lot of users and a lot of data in this course we're not going to talk about that so we only going to talk about the state that's all we're going to do now, if you don't know what state is, I would encourage you to go to the React.js free course that we have on our Nomad Academy. So, now that I have this, I will just uh, delete everything. Okay, lovely. And let's look at what we have to do. All right, first thing, we need to get the color of this background the color is i find it on my sketch all right so let's create a screen huh let's do it so all we have to do is that we are going to just let me make this a little bit prettier all right all we have to do is that we are going to start constructing the state all right and we when i say construct the state i say state and I start doing it. So the state will have, uh, apart from the weather data, is gonna have also um, Boolean value, an indicator that will tell us if we already downloaded or not the data on our uh, app. So the way we are gonna do this is I'm going to create a key. is loaded. And by default, it's gonna be in false. All right, that's it. So, I am going to make a conditional statement inside of my render function that will check if it's loaded, it's going to show them the weather. If it's not loaded, it's going to show them um, the loading screen, okay, the loading view. So let's check that out. Before here, I just say const is loaded. All right, so I can say is loaded. If it is loaded, show them something. In this case, we cannot show them anything because we don't have the data yet. So we're gonna only talk about this, the, the screen that happens when we are not loaded, all right? So the screen that happens is this one, view, first of all, and then a text that says, uh, getting the fucking weather. getting the fucking weather and we close the text and we also close the view now if we look here null is not a load object is loaded false is loaded oh we cannot return no oh yeah here it is getting the fucking weather as you can see now while i do this i am going to install a nice extension that I have for making my JavaScript pretty. Okay, it's gonna install it very quick. It shouldn't take long. All right, so we create the view and now we are going to create this view and the style will be styles loading. Loading. Okay, styles loading. So here I'm going to create the styles loading. You know what? I am going to remove this uppercase loading. Okay. So loading will have a background color of the one we had in the sketch, which is this one. Perfect. In a string, because it's not a variable, and we are gonna save. We'll see. Background color. And as you can see, it's not full width right this this is because we haven't done flex one 
okay and we will remove all the lines that we did on our other video about flexbox all right getting the fucking weather now it's full screen next let's put this text the bottom the, all we have to do is just say justify content after the fucking comma justify content and we say flex end boom now we have here getting the fucking weather lovely i want to add some padding so i'm going to add a 24 to 24 yeah 24 padding but should i add this padding to the father or should i add this padding to the uh text i think maybe ah, let's do it for the text so the text i want to call this style loading text before i save i'm going to assign this name as you can see this is basically like class naming or something super cool and styles loading text loading text is over here and the font size is 30. save let's see what happens here it is getting the fucking weather now i believe it could be bigger let's make it bigger just for the lots boom here, here it is before we continue we need to let's just give it a little bit of a margin bottom oh this is my css background you see this this is my css background bottom there it is and the margin bottom of this will be wow almost 100 let's do 100 and it looks lovely and now let's give it a let's give the loading a padding right of oh this is 25 whoop 25 all right we save and what happens oh sorry padding left fucking idiot padding left boom saved and there we go and just like that my dear friends we have the loading screen super easy is almost css all you have to remember is that we just do views we also do text and we just create flex background justify content some padding some margin and that's it something i forgot to mention is that with react native we don't have the shorthand properties or at least i don't think fucking know like this padding and I do something like 40 and then 30 and then 50 and then 60. Let's see. Nope. I can't. Maybe like this. I'm just talking shorthand, shorthand properties. Maybe this works. No, it doesn't work here. It doesn't work, doesn't work. Yep, doesn't work. It shows me an error and everything. Yeah, it doesn't work. Bye bye. What just happened? close this okay all right so we have our getting the fucking weather let's do it quick quick recap first i create a state inside of my component that it says is loaded false now we're gonna call an api and then we're gonna change when we have the weather of our um, user when we have the weather of that person we are going to come back with the data and we are going to change this the state key to true all right but in the meantime is in loading false all right is is loaded is false because it hasn't loaded yet inside of this component i create a condition and i ask it is it loaded if it is loaded we don't have anything to show yet so we say null if it's not loaded show them this view all right and by default is not loaded is false so it's going to go to this conditional part okay and now here we all we did was change the background color we justify the content we, we we did some padding to the left we did flex one super simple and then we created the text and we gave some styles to the text font size and margin bottom and that's all we did 
So see you on the next uh, video where we are going to talk about building the weather view. So we're going to make a fake weather screen to see how it goes. See you there.